I wish I had my glasses. Hi, Lena. Tiny furniture and girls are both very important to me, so thanks for making them. I could have written that. <laughs> What is, the, what is the one thing you know at this point in your career that you wish you had known when you were just starting out? Thanks. That's a great question, Ellen. <laughs> and she wrote a heart. That's really nice. I love it. Thank you, Ellen. Well, I would say, and this is something that you've helped me learn, that it was really important for me to realize that it's okay to say, I don't know. Like, that was something that, at first, I was so afraid of being sort of, I think a lot of people, and especially a lot of women, have that strong sense of imposter syndrome. And as young women, you feel like you haven't, paid your due or that you're not in a position to assert yourself or express yourself. And so I was very afraid to ever falter. And I spent a lot of time trying to pretend that I knew things that I didn't. And now just getting to a comfortable place of saying, I don't know, and that's okay because there's other things I do know. That's just the one that, I mean, I've learned so much from working with you, from working with Judd, but that was one that stuck with me was not to be, a, not to feel that um, so kind of, uh, weighted down by my status as a young female person that I tried to kind of like affect this bravado that wasn't real because when you say I don't know people's first reaction is to go like well I'll I know and I'll help you especially when you're surrounding yourself by people who should know yeah and that was really exciting and I wish that I could like go in and shake my 24 year old self and say you don't have to walk oh, yeah in. you blew it <laughs> Wow. <laughs> but I definitely could have, like, saved myself a lot of extreme in-meetings anxiety. Right. Yeah. But the, you meant a career thing. There's a lot of, you know, sexual stuff I could tell you. 